Hello, my name is Sanne and I am uh, making this video from Bonaire. I made like a uh, zooming in because some people have no clue what Bonaire is. What is actually pretty logical because it's really small and maybe not many people have heard of it. So, um, yes, let me uh, start the video. Here you see, I'm, of, I'm making this video from... Um, yeah, that really small, tiny, tiny island in the Caribbean Sea. And what the coolest thing is, we already tried. Oh, yeah, I have to say this is Salt Pier. That's where uh, we went because we wanted to spot the oct octo that's there. And uh, we went there the first time. This is the Salt Pier, very famous spot in uh, on Bonaire. And we saw him. This is like a still from the video. And we will get to there because we first went there and uh, we put the camera down and we only saw fishes. There was no octo. But now we went there. Oh, I think he's doing something funny there. But we went there and we found him so we could feed him some shrimps. Yeah, that was so cool. I think that the reef octopus, it's one of the most beautiful, beautiful species. Species. Um, yeah, that you can watch. And But I also, I love all the other fishes, you know. I think for me, I, I'm, uh, oh yeah, it fell down. Now we have like a metal piece mounted underneath the camera, so uh, it won't fall down so quickly. But, you know, I, I'm really good at uh, giving fish uh, human, like, Characteristics like the damselfish, I think it's really like territorial, um, and the angelfish is like really curious and nosy. He wants to see you and follow you around, and it's like they're all very curious here. All the small cute fishes. I just love to look at this because normally I would take the camera and then follow fishes and film coral reefs but i really love that the, uh, peter actually he was talking about uh, the movie or documentary about um my octopus teacher or my octopus friend i don't know and he said oh we should try that too and he it was his idea to just put the camera there and then feed the octopus so that's what we did here and i think Okay, we already saw the octopus. That was pretty cool. And the next video, let me check. I didn't paste it next to... Yeah. Oh, and you see the bleaching of the coral. It's terrible. But okay. Uh, it's like a disease spreading in the, in the coral reefs. But okay. We... Uh, yeah, this is like a little bit better aim, I think. And there you see smooth trunk fish i think those are really cute too because they're like have really tiny fins and they're like going on the uh you know trying to maintain but here we, we have the oh i think it's so interesting you know all the fishes like it of course oh and then he goes for it and then the camera falls down yeah and that's me i'm like oh shit that's not good. But I have a few more shrimps over there. So this I uh, we went there on the 24th on Sunday. I was so happy to find finally see the octopus. But yeah, okay, the camera position is not good yet. But in the next video, I made up on yesterday, you will see some more. But it's like, I really, you know, the yellow one, the damselfish over there, he's so nosy. I really like it that he's like checking out in front of the screen. I think that's so cool. And also these striped ones. I don't know those ones. And I think Peter's brother also asked about it, what it was. I have no clue. Did he answer you? That one in the middle. What is that? I don't know. And there goes a shrimp. But is the octopus coming up? Yeah. Doesn't this look beautiful? I think he's searching on the ground if, if there's more or something like that. Oh, and then my camera falls again. Yeah, okay. 
What a shame. What a shame! Here I am again, trying to... Let me think. Oh, no! Didn't work! <laughs> again! Is it now steady? I don't know. <laughs> there it is! A damsel fish again! Yeah, that's funny. I th don't you, it's just... I think it's so nice to just look at all the other fish that are around there. So pretty. He got it. So the fish actually have zero chance to <laughs> enjoy the, the shrimp. I mean, the octopus is so fast. And now he's like sitting on it, really going for it. <laughs> Some surgeon fishes passing by. Sergeant Major. And with this, when you put the camera down, you can just look at the fishes you know and they don't swim away they they are coming to the camera and you see them from the front which i think is really nice <laughs> there he is again <laughs> that's my favorite i should give him a name and it's so busy you see this is like typical coral in on Bonaire, and that's really one of the reasons what i love about Bonaire. you can just go into the water and see this wherever you go uh, it's, it's, except for like the downtown center although you also have a little bit coral there but not so much but this is like yeah i think this is this makes bonaire really amazing and when i was snorkeling here i already saw like five turtles i made a short about that i saw it like i went that in the water five minutes later bam bam two turtles i look around i see a, a baby turtle and i will Peter said it was not a baby turtle, but maybe a female. I don't know. It was smaller. Just going up for air and down. And there, that day, there were so many turtles. They were really cool. I love that. And then, of course, finally, we found Octo. And we could give him some shrimps. Although now he doesn't fit in his small uh, home anymore. And how you can recognize, that's what Peter told me, if there are shrimps, uh, if there's an octopus or not is when there are shells in front of something. So he eats fishes from out of, of fishes. What do you call that? Yeah. He eats the animals that are sitting inside the shell and he just takes it to his place where he lives. And then he just throws the shell out of the front door. It's not really a clean, uh, yeah, maybe you also use it for protection. I don't know. But this is how you can recognize like the home of a uh, reef octopus if, if it's like, if there's shells everywhere and you also see them here in front of his place but now he's so big he cannot get in anymore oh yeah and here you have like <laughs> Dor dory from dora dora is it dora i don't know from finding nemo isn't this cool that you can look at the fish this way i love it i really like it and it's like the moment when I go down, you see also the color of the octopus change. That's also pretty cool. I think uh, you see that here, that he goes dark. It's so beautiful. And you know, when they're like hanging in the in the water like that they're actually waiting for other fishes to clean them it's like a cleaning station and you see a very small you saw a very small fish just clean him it's really really cool i think and i also i think that's also this video that i saw like a like a maybe mating dance from two surgeon fishes that was really interesting 
Ah, there, you see. They were like for a couple of minutes swimming like completely synchronized and then around turning around each other and I don't know, it looked very beautiful. Here. Philip. So beautiful. And they were doing that for like five minutes, I don't know. I was hanging above it. It looked beautiful. You see, it's getting darker. He thinks, oh no, go away, human, or give me more shrimps. Ooh. You see the mess he made. And that was it. Only on Bonaire. <laughs> it's so cool. Well, thank you for watching. This was it. See you next one. Bye bye.